Hey everybody, what's going on? Zerktick here with the long-awaited episode 4 of my Full Sync series. The series in which I try to win a match with an additional objective in order to achieve Full Sync. Now, um, in this match, the challenge is to throw Money Bomb after I kill my targets. So every single time I kill a target, I have to throw Money Bomb. Which means I have to have Money Bomb off cooldown in order for me to even go after my targets. So that's kind of what made this challenge challenging. <laughs> and as you guys can see, I'm using Disguise Knives. No, this is not the default set. My perks and um, streaks are custom. But, uh, yeah, this is a, de this, as far as the abilities, it is, a, you know, it is the default set. So if, even if you guys don't even have a legit set, like if you're level 1 or 2 and you're watching this video and you want to do this challenge, do it. Although I do not think you will do well because I'm assuming you wouldn't have that much experience with the multiplayer. Yeah, but anyway, after it takes me about 45 seconds to figure out, or not even, not 35 seconds to figure out who uh, my target is in the beginning of the match, finally get him, throw a money bomb down, and I added an optional objective, uh, which is to taunt. And the reason I'm using the Monty Bank in this game is because he looks like a pimp, and he likes to make it rain on him. <laughs> and uh, I like his taunt, he just has so much swag, so um, I thought he would be the perfect persona to play as while doing this challenge. <laughs> so right here I'm gonna get a knife stun after this chick tries to chase kill me and I notice the lure in the corner. So I go after this guy and punch him. Very very nice. Um, stunning is going to be your main source of points because you have to accommodate for the fact that you have to have uh, money bomb off cooldown in order to kill your targets. So um, be wary of that if you attempt this challenge. Every time you kill somebody you must throw uh, money bomb. So yeah. <laughs> and like I said, every time I, like right here, you're about to see me kill this chick. Um, every time I kill somebody and I know there's not that many pursuers around me, I <laughs> throw down Money Bomb. And then I do a little little, little taunt, little pimp swag action. Just because, uh, you know, the Monty Bank don't give a fuck. <laughs> but I was starting to hear whispers, so I popped this guy's going around this corner. Hop in this blend group, looking around for my pursuer. There he is, being all obvious like with his jitter walk. So uh, I lock on him, which is very, very smart, because he's going around the corner and he's running. And uh, I'm just going to follow him and get me a nice corner stun. I'm going to get a lot of corner stuns in this match. <clears throat> and uh, I would also advise if you guys want to make this challenge easier on yourselves, probably you might want to use Smoke Bomb just because, like I said, stunning is going to be your main source of points when attempting this challenge because you're limited on uh, when you can kill your opponent. So, Yeah. But, uh, hopping in blend groups. Moving in blend groups. Uh, this person is just rabid as hell. I should have thrown knives there, but I didn't think she was going to stop at the last second like she did. So I just went for the naked stun. I thought she was confused, but obviously she was not, so that sucks. But what can you do? Have Money Bomb off cooldown so I can go after my target and play as I would normally. Again, I'm after this pioneer. <clears throat> so yeah, uh, this was a very fun challenge. This was, I think, the third time I attempted it. The first time I attempted it, I actually completed it. I came in first. I actually tied for first with somebody else. Um, but I thought this match was definitely more entertaining. I got a lot more stuns and stuff, so I thought I'd upload this one. Um, but yeah, right here I'm just going to do shit out a little bit and go for corner stuns. Um, I do have knives and disguise, so I could have you know, just tried to fool my opponents that way. But I thought the corner stun route was better at the time. It was a better choice at the time. Right here, I noticed the Pioneer come running after she sees me stun the bear so I can get a punch off on her. And then this chick, being so intelligent and rabid, goes around the other corner and just chase kills me. So, what can you do? Is what it is. Uh, I'm in a... I have a commanding lead right now. So that's good. And I'm about to have Money Bomb off cooldown so I can go for another kill. <coughs> yeah, yeah. So this person's gonna knife me. I'm gonna walk away, knife her, and then stun her right through her smoke. Bitch! Take it. Right here, I thought I was gonna get, get away with this corner stun, but she obviously had me locked, so. I did not get away with my life on that one. But what can you do? Is what it is. Um, really glad you guys enjoyed my 700 sub special uh, that I just uploaded. Um, this is actually, this commentary is actually being recorded a few hours before my open lobby. So, uh, this video will probably up be uploaded around the same time the open lo lobby will be taking place. So, uh, 
yeah. Um, I don't know exactly what I'm going to do as far as the open lobby footage. I may make a montage. I may make, you know, do a few videos off of it. I don't know, depending upon how many matches I get. This asshole shooting me. Fuck you. But, um, yeah, we shall see. I'm not entirely sure what I'm going to do in that, uh, with that situation. But we shall see. Um, I'm on the Twitters now, by the way. If you guys didn't see my last video, I am on the Twitters. Um, it's actually pretty cool, the Twitters. I'm getting used to it. It is a very cool... Wait, hold on. Gotta cut myself off. Alright, I'm gonna kill this guy, right? Pay attention. I, I released mo... Alright, right there. You saw, saw, saw? Money Bomb was deployed. I promise. Look, it's off cooldown now. In game, I wasn't even... I wasn't even sure if I, uh, had thrown Money Bomb down, but then I realized that the... You know, it went on cooldown, so... And I got the Troublemaker thing, so I was like, yes, I did it. I almost fucked up the full sink. Um, but yeah, so... I just wanted to point that out so you guys know. I, I did throw money bomb there. <laughs> but, um, that was I saying. Yeah, I'm on Twitter now, so I'll put the link in the description. You guys can follow me or whatever, and I will follow you. Because uh, the conversation on Twitter is really, really cool. All the different things that the AC community is talking about, and they're a lot cooler on Twitter, I think. We, we, we have a, we're more tight-knit over there, so it's, uh, it's pretty cool. So, yeah. Check me out on the Twitters. <coughs> did a little taunt there because I knew there was nobody around me so <laughs> that is an optional thing you do not have to taunt after you throw the money bomb down but uh, I just thought it was funny because the Monty Bank looks like such a pimp pimp daddy <clears throat> here I'm gonna pop this guy's hop in the bland group I use a lot of bland groups with this challenge just because I really have no true defensive abilities and this helps um, keep me in cover I guess and uh, yeah I found I was playing a, a little bit more stealthier than I normally would too because of this challenge because like I said there's like a few seconds where I can't kill anybody because I have to wait for money bombs so I have to just wait for pursuers and normally I wouldn't do that normally I would just go after my target because I'm kill happy and uh, bloodthirsty but uh, what can you do <laughs> right there I get stunned I figured uh, going after the stun was more um in yeah it was more intelligent to go after the stun there rather than uh, the kill because money bombs still had like five seconds and uh, I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to, you know, throw it down on her dead corpse. And right here I make a, a, a boo-boo. I make a little bit of a boo-boo. I went for a corner stun here because I thought that this bear right here was after me, but he is not. I don't even know why I thought that. He was walking like an NPC, but, uh, got paranoid. Damn it. But, uh, <laughs> what can you do? What can you do? Yeah, buddy. Oh, I'm also working on a montage. I have an absurd amount of clips. I'm cutting them up. Uh, I've been cutting them up the past few days to uh, do a little montage, so hopefully that'll be coming out soon. Um, it'll be better than my last one. I know my last one kind of sucked just because it was pretty mediocre clips, um, so this time I will uh, I will hopefully, uh, it will hopefully be better, and you guys will hopefully enjoy that as well. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? But yeah, but yeah. Around two more minutes left right here. I'm locking on to the Huntsman. And, of course, I get my kill stolen by this rabid bitch. What can you do? Get me a ground finish for Variety. And she is going to smoke. I did not notice the Pioneer. I did not. I was pressing square like a madman trying to kill. I don't even know who what. Oh, the, uh, the Scotsman. What the fuck is his name? The Highlander. <laughs> I was going to stun him, but uh, the Pioneer just popped out of nowhere. I was not trying to punch her. She, uh, she uh, kind of got screwed in that situation. She could have got a nice kill on me because I didn't know it was her. Um, but yeah. Alright, so no pursuers. Money bombs off cooldown. But I have no target, so I can't run in. So I'm going to stay in the middle of the map. And uh, there he is. So, uh, oh, of course. Of course. Contract lost. Bitch. So, uh, yeah, I'm staying in the middle of the map. D map. I don't have any pursuers. Now I have pursuers. Now I have a target. Um, there's my pursuer, throw knives, wasn't sure if she had smoke, so I was cautious, and I was able to stun her. I'm gonna get the hell out of dodge. <clears throat> my target's that way, but I don't want to go after my target, I want to get this escape. Because, uh, I would have to get a really shitty kill if I went after my target there, and I didn't want to do that, so I just, uh, decided to try and go for the escape, and I get the out of sight escape because somebody kills my pursuer, which is awesome. Right here, I know I have no shot at getting my target, so I don't even go after her. I just say, fuck it. Just find the nearest blend group and wait for a pursuer to come by. About 30 seconds left. I know I have the match in the bag. I have a commanding lead. 
what is it, like 2k or something like that, so. I was successful in completing the Money Bomb Challenge. Right here, I get a reverse drop stun. Very nice. I knew that, or I didn't know, but I had a feeling that that guy knew who I was, even though I was disguised, because I disguised so late, and the way I was walking. So I just went for the reverse drop stun. But, uh, yeah, that's it. I end the match right here by throwing Money Bomb and taunting the fucking camera, because I'm a boss. And, uh, the Monty Bank is such a pimp. Pimp swag. Yeah. <laughs> but that is... That is episode 4 of my full sync series, everybody. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, I definitely encourage you guys to try this challenge out. It was a lot of fun. You gotta change up your playstyle a little bit. And you can play, like I said, in any game mode. It does not bother me. Who gives a shit? I just feel like Wanted is the best all-around game mode for these challenges. But, uh, yeah. I only got 5 kills. That is that is weird for me. I, I normally average around 10 kills in Wanted. But, uh, yeah. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the match. And uh, I will talk to y'all later. Peace.